These are used military boots. I forgot what brand they are, but I'll probably put it down in the comments. They're intermediate cold weather, so they're Gore-Tex lined. Um, you see the Gore-Tex label right there. Made in the USA. Um, the other brand is, I forgot. But they're not, they're basically brand new. Look at the heels. Look at that. They're brand new. See the heels? They're freaking brand new. And, and this here, you could do this instead of walking it for 10 minutes. I think they're pr probably used maybe, I don't think they're walked a mile in them for crying out loud. So I paid 20 bucks for them, 12 bucks shipping. They retail for $110. And usually the shipping is like 15, 20 bucks. So I paid $32 for something that would actually be running me about $135. So how's that? And you say, well, you know, I would never buy used boots. Well, <laughs> um, probably, well, that's why, I guess that's why they're, you know, I'm just putting it out here because most people won't do that. But the thing is, uh, you know, if you buy these ones in Walmart, even the ones that are the higher quality Chinese made things, because everybody's selling out to China now, there's very few shoes now made in the United States. And uh, if you're getting something mil spec, and I'm not talking, Mill spec Chinese knockoff, you know, jungle boots for 40 bucks or some crap. Those things fall apart, man. I bought one of those. They looked exactly like the military ones. The the quality is crap. The glue and everything that holds a salt, it falls apart, man. They're pure pure shit. Um, so I, I had some, uh, you know, these are just the everyday knockarounds. So before I put them on and get them all dirty, I want to show you what the hell they look like because they're not going to look like this and probably. 48 hours from now because they're tan but um, I if you paid 50 bucks for some not no name brand of boots that were made in China from like a retailer like Walmart or something they wouldn't be anywhere near this quality these boots would outlast I got boots from the when I was in the military of course I haven't been using them but um, you know, all the time, but just one pair I do. I mean, they're freaking like 30 years old. Shit, when the hell was I in the military? Got out in 95, so that was 25 years ago. They're, they're about 30 years old. They're still fine. <laughs> and now I can tell you, I don't know how many pairs of freaking good deals of boots I got out of Walmart or some crappy place like that, and they fell apart. They look nice, but then when you actually go to use them, they fall apart. And stuff like this, you can actually use some of these other things. Um, I wouldn't even get Reeboks over this or some other name brand or Nike or some other bullshit brand out there that's a hundred something dollars. I wouldn't even get that over these. These USA, the ones that the military uses, they got to be good. They got to be good. And of course, you know, you got to maintain them if you get them screwed up in weather and stuff. But these are, uh, you know, I don't know. Just putting it out here because, like I said, people do not, you know, they don't think of doing shit like this because it's, you know, it's used. I wouldn't think about it, but, you know. I got another pair of boots. They're, they're never even worn. They had the tear, t tags on them. Motorcycle boots. Yeah, I put the door sweeps in here, the windows. I finally did that. I did that one. And uh, <laughs> I did the other side. I was going to get out there and do the flagging, but kind of got going here late but when I'm looking at the flags out here really no wind so probably just as well I didn't go out there uh, gotta change the oil on this thing change the oil on that thing change the oil on this thing change the oil on that thing <laughs> anyway I'll probably get to that today uh, but uh, I'll probably get some more of these banners and stuff because the internet is so uh, restrictive today can't say nothing so if you want to get your opinion out there you might as well print up a banner <laughs> anyway over and out yeah and I forgot what brand these are but they're one they're not McRae I got another pair of McRae's a few years ago that I used quite a bit too and um, I forgot what I paid for them but they're still fine I'm telling you, man, this U.S. U.S. surplus stuff, man, is the best shit in the world to get. I've actually got 
uh, like the cami tops for uh, I got loads of extra ones but I got a couple more they were Air Force ones I think I paid brand new I think they paid eight bucks each for them at some place that was selling them just getting rid of them brand new brand new eight bucks so you know everybody will be should be wearing green and tan maybe huh <laughs>